Now here's one that's the opposite, which is very simple to do, and that's voice recognition. So um, please know this is not speech recognition. You don't have to understand what the person is saying. You, you are recognizing the speaker, the pattern of speech. So typically you ask someone to read a sentence and then you compare it to a pre-recorded uh, sequence in the system to see if, if it matches more or less. It's very low cost, so there is almost no hardware you require, just a simple microphone and very simple software. But it's not very accurate. That's the main problem because the voice of a person changes all the time. It's different in the morning, it's different in the evening, it's different if somebody has a cold. Um, it even varies whether you're outside or inside. So it's a very um, inaccurate technology and it's also subject to noise. So there is all kinds of background noise that makes the recognition um, possible. But the worst part about this is that it's not very secure because it can be stolen. It's very easy to record um, this sentence that somebody is saying and then play it back. So it really does not identify the person. You can very easily fake if you have a copy of it. You could very easily do that, which you cannot do with um, other means like the face recognition or, or, or fingerprint.